Hi there. Now that you know how to fly, basically, let's get you out there exploring the universe. So, let's assume you've woken up in your easy hab, made your way to deck one, retrieved your aurora at an ASOP terminal, located your ship, gotten in, fired it up, and gotten the heck out of Allsar. You with me? Now, let's select a destination. We can do this via the skyline feature in the Moby Glass. Press F1 to bring up the Moby Glass. Navigate to the skyline application. You can also automatically open skyline using the F2 key. Once in the app, you'll see this nifty 3D star map. You can use the scroll wheel to zoom out, the left mouse click to rotate, and you can use the right mouse click to drag the map around. Around you, you can see a couple of points of interest. You can also travel across the system to the planet Hurston, its moons, and further points of interest. But for now, let's head to one of Crusader's moons, Yella. First, click on Yella. You'll notice a path is generated on the star map from you to Yella. Click on Set Route to confirm your choice. Skyline will then let you know how much fuel is needed for the intended journey and how much you currently have in the tank. From here, you can go ahead and exit the Moby Glass by pressing F1 again. You'll now need to align the ship with Yella by lining up the nose with the destination marker on your HUD. Once aligned, as you can see, there is quite some distance between you and the destination. And given the speed you're currently traveling at, you won't make it there anytime soon. Don't worry though, the Aurora MR and most ships come equipped with a quantum drive. A quantum drive will let us cover the distance to Yella in a fraction of the time. To use it, stay aligned with Yella until calibration has reached 100%. But right now, you may be coming to the conclusion that some quantum drives take a bit of time to calibrate. And quantum travel itself also takes a while, depending on how far you're going. Luckily, you have your Moby Glass. QT is a great time to explore it. Peruse contracts, scan channels, tinker with your loadout. You know, whatever. Oh, here we go. Once your drive is calibrated, press B to start spooling. To speed up this whole process a bit, you can start your spool while the drive is calibrating. Either way, once the drive is fully spooled, press and hold B for a short period of time. Once quantum travel is engaged, you can let go of the key. As you've probably noticed, space travel takes a while, even when using your quantum drive. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. There it is, Yella, Crusader's Icy Moon. You made it! Quantum drive but what if off. the area you want to visit is on the other side of the moon? Well, open your Moby Glass again and hop back into Skyline. Rotate the map using the left mouse button and find a point of interest on the far side of Yella. There, how about that mining station? Click on it. Click on Set Route. Close your Moby Glass with F1. Now, you're already familiar with the QT process, so let's speed it up this time. Once calibrated, engage your quantum drive. Remember that's B to spool, and then holding B again to engage, and you'll automatically swing around the moon to your destination. Pretty cool, right? Of course, you'll still have to manually close the gap between you and wherever it is you're actually headed. Use your throttle and bring her in. Now, to land, all you have to do is line yourself up with the moon's surface like so, make sure your landing gear is deployed, set your ship down, Nice and gentle. What, what is this, your first time landing on a moon? Oh, I guess it is. Never mind. To get out, use and hold the F key to exit your chair. Then F again to leave the cockpit. Now, you can take in the natural beauty of yellow. Just keep an eye on your oxygen and vitals, and whatever you do, don't take your helmet off. Now that you have the basics down, get out there and have some adventures. Take a contract. Try a scramble race. Travel to Hurston and see the big city. Hey, it's up to you. The main thing to remember is have fun, and we'll see you in the verse. Like and share if you enjoy the video and think others might benefit from this. And of course, subscribe and hit the notification button if you are new to the channel and want to be notified every time I post a video.